Okay, Nora and Finn are looking for lizards and it is the cutest thing I think I've ever seen. Finn will go into a bush and look and then Nora will go into the same one. Do you see one, Nora? Did Finny, did Finny find one? She just laughs. Did you find one, Finn? Did he find one? Look at this. That's the cutest thing. Yeah, does he, does he find a little tree? Oh my goodness. Will you tell Finn to come? Come! Say, let's go to the park. Park! You want to go to the park? I'm excited! I'm so excited. <laughs> He's so excited! Oh my gosh, I can't think of a better way to start our morning. This is so fun. We got Shell here. Uncle Jared's coming in a little bit. He just ran to the gym, which is awesome. Wow! And Nora, can I see your sunglasses? Can you guys even handle? Look at their purple, yeah. purple sunglasses, purple shirt. You guys are a little too cute. Come here, Finny. All right, we just got to the park. So Finn loves this park because there are squirrels everywhere. He goes to every tree and he looks for them. It's his favorite thing. Nora loves the park because of the playground, huh? Having a little snack right now. They got a little tire coming over here. Come here, Finn. Let's go. All right, there's a squirrel over on this trash can right here. Can you go get it? Do you see it, dude? All right, we got the little squirrel right here. Can you look? Do you see it? Oh, oh. You guys, he tries to climb the tree and it's the cutest. Finish just eyeing the tree that the squirrel is in. He won't take his eyes off of it. Good boy, Finn. Look at that smile. Oh my goodness. I think Finn is tuckered out, Nora is tuckered out, Shell and I are a little bit tuckered out. But seriously, not a better way to start our morning. Jared is editing right now, and I'm gonna make one of our favorite things. I have not made this on the vlog in a while, but you guys know we love our protein smoothies, and as you know, we have a trip coming up. We're trying to eat a little healthier around here, so I thought I would share this. Michelle is actually the one that gave me this recipe. We had this at her house in New York, what, Shell? A couple years ago, yeah. I feel like, but it's super easy, super delicious. Um, we've talked about Clean Simple Eats before. This is by far, it's my favorite flavor shell. What's your favorite flavor? That one. This one? Yeah. This is the caramel toffee, you guys, so it kind of just has like a caramel cinnamon flavor to it. There's like plain chocolate ones. Yeah, that one's really good. You can do a lot of like berries and peanut butter and stuff with that. But anyways, I love this one. So basically, it's a scoop of that. We do a scoop of rolled oats. These are just from Trader Joe's, but you can use whatever you want. Kind of makes it more filling and have more texture. Um, a ton of spinach in here. A little bit of cinnamon, ice. I already have ice. You can see kind of filled up halfway. And then also half of a banana and then just some oat milk. And we actually do have a code for Clean Simple Eats. Michelle uses our code all the time so i will put that down in the description in case you want to try it but i'm gonna go ahead blend this up you guys every morning there's nora and finn both begging for food then they run and play with their toys and then come back it's so cute
such a fun day at the beach, you guys. It was sunny and beautiful. Heck yeah, beach day. That was like our first official beach day in a long time, you know, during the day, things like that. I mean, we went to the beach last night for the sunset, but this time we were all in swimsuits, had so much fun. Nora found seashells. She, it's kind of like the first time where she's old enough to understand like seashells and she was looking for birds and she, she was saying fish, but obviously we didn't. It was so cute. So we are heading over to one of Michelle's favorite restaurants and ours as well, Louis Bossi's Best Italian in Fort Lauderdale. Yes. And we are taking our favorite road to get there, you guys, this street. This area is called Victoria Park here, and it is just like this beautiful neighborhood. We've showed it quite a few times, but it's been a while. It's just tree-lined streets and the trees like hang over and it's just so beautiful. We got an early reservation, that way Nora can go to bed because this is their last full day here, which is uh, so sad. I know, we don't want to talk about it. We also it. got an early reservation just because we know that we're going to play about nine straight hours of Settlers of Catan. Settlers of Catan tonight, <laughs> we had it all in. We have loved having Michelle and Nora here. I know we, I said last night like I never want them to leave, but seriously, <laughs> like, Nate just moved down here. <laughs> Work remotely. Send our things. Yeah, send your, send the stuff. We're good to go. Ah, <laughs> uh, Louis Bossy's part of a balanced lunch. <laughs> This is so good. Seriously, I love that place. Come by. <laughs> it was so, so good. So good. So if you guys happen to go there, which you should if you come to Fort Lauderdale, our favorite by far, we've tried quite a few dishes, but our personal favorite, I know it sounds so simple, but it's just the spaghetti and meatballs. Yes, it's honestly amazing. It tastes so good. They just do it right. It's just like the simple, delicious sauce with the fresh pasta, homemade. Oh. Can't be beat. What's also the best is look at Nora in her cute. You want me to get you? Yeah. Okay. Oh, We're I'm gonna, gonna get her. Get. Look at her in her cute little tennis dress. Get her, Jerry. Hey, this is She's running. For any of you that may be new to our channel, this is called Las Olas Boulevard. If you guys come here, like on a cruise, you got a little bit of time to spare. Definitely check out Las Olas. It's really cool. Tons of shops, tons of places to eat. Restaurants. Really cool. And I was just telling Michelle. Michelle, did you see this? It's called Candle Land, and you can literally make your own candles inside. How fun is that? Well, we're gonna have to go do that maybe for a little date night or something. Yeah. Are you a lion? Yeah. <laughs> Rawr. <laughs> you guys, he's so cute. So this is the road that runs all along the east coast of Florida. But look how beautiful the sunset is tonight. We are noticing it's so busy. They have some events going on this week and there's always, I feel like, different events going yeah, on down here. Yeah, there's tons of them going on. If you go further south, you run into like all the hotels and the tourist areas. Yeah, and where we live like is that. like right at the end of all that stuff. Yeah. It's kind of like just locals. And but it's super fun to like drive by, go walk around down there, especially when we have people in town visiting, things oh, like yeah, that. Oh yeah, definitely really fun. I mean, this is like the first street we drove down like when we moved here. Oh my gosh. Finn saw the ocean for the first time. Let us know if you remember Finn sticking his little head out right here, like smelling the ocean here. It was the sweetest thing ever. I know. That's I one mean, of our favorite memories. I've been down this street like a hundred times and it never gets old. I love it. I mean, come on. Looking at the beach as you drive home, it's just, it's incredible. Another thing when you come to Fort Lauderdale, there's all the different draw bridges that go up because there's the intercoastal right here. And so all the sailboats and the bigger yachts and things like that have to go underneath them. So they raise up to let all of the boats go through. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> Do you hear her? <laughs> he got it! Oh my 
gosh, that was the cutest. We are back home with little Finners, and of course, him and Nora are doing the keep away. Oh no! Oh, Feeny, get it! Oh no! <laughs> oh my goodness! Oh my gosh, we're back home with our little Finners. He's so happy. You guys, he's still adjusting to be alone as we go in, but he's getting better. Today yeah, he didn't he bark. We didn't have to get on the dog camera at all and talk yep. to him. We didn't get a single notification. Which was great. We didn't have yeah. to worry about him while we were so gone. Cool, huh? Also, when we got back, we had some mail at the door I'm super excited about. We had the sweetest delivery ever. So many of you guys know Jared's brother, Brandon, and his yeah. wife, Minnie, and their darling family from This Is Howie Bingham. They sent us the sweetest cookies ever. So these are from Stephanie, Mindy's friend. Yeah. They're cookies by Steph. If you guys are ever looking for like custom cookies, she's amazing. But look how darling. There's like a J, a B, hearts, flowers, sending love. And they wrote us a really nice card. I know, the nicest card ever. Seriously, <laughs> this was like the sweetest surprise to come yeah. home to. Yeah, oh my nice. gosh. Thank you guys. People are so thoughtful. So many of you guys have been sending us cards. Really though, just getting things in the mail, just knowing people are praying for us, thinking of us, it just totally brightened our I day. need to uh, break one of these open. I know, but seriously, like just the thoughtfulness behind wow. every gesture that's been showed to us over the past month has been kind of overwhelming. So. Not a detail that's in this. It's really good. I know, they're yeah. amazing. Their cute card brought us to tears. So, yeah. so sweet. Cannot thank them enough. Seriously, yeah, thank you again, you guys. Like, it was very thoughtful of you. We really appreciate it. So, so thoughtful. And then, also, I was kind of excited because I ordered some new sheets off of Amazon that had really great reviews because, as you guys know, our guest room yes. gets used a lot. We are in dire need of some new sheets because we do have another visitor coming yep. the day after Shell leaves. Yep. Which we're super excited about. We have mentioned who it is in another video, so... <laughs> If you know who's coming, you know, but if you don't, you know, then it may know. be a surprise to you. Oh yeah, those are so soft. So these are the Milani linen sheets. You guys may feel that. It feels like a hotel. This is their hotel collection. Oh, that does feel like a hotel. And the price point <laughs> on this was really good, you guys. I think this was around like 40 bucks for a team sheet, which yeah, is that's really actually a really good, good price. Deal. And I also ordered a bed skirt because we don't have one for that. Nice, either, baby. So. Nice. Anyways, also got my favorite sunscreen I've been out of. Guys, if you're looking for a good sunscreen, this is my favorite. Just yeah. get off Amazon. This is the Image Skincare. It's so good. I use this every day, no matter what. I put it on under my makeup and it's my moisturizer, and it's amazing. So. Yeah, I think between that and your bronzer, that's the things we get asked about the most. Oh, yeah. Yeah. I'm the no makeup guru expert, but I love this a yeah. lot. So. We will link all this stuff down below.